Americans goaltender Joel Rumpel. Well, first of all, welcome to Allen. Uh, nothing like a baptism by fire. Man, we threw you right in there for the Wolves. How did it feel? It was good. I mean, uh, obviously, playing college hockey before, it's, uh, it's obviously a step up coming to play in your first pro game. A little nervous out there, but uh, I think it went pretty well. And uh, a Wisconsin grad. Exciting times right now for that school. How much do you pay attention to the basketball team and what they've been doing? And everybody knows Big Frank and Frank the Tank and what he's been doing for that school. Uh, did you interact at all with the guys on the other teams? Yeah, I mean, we played the same rink in, uh, in Wisconsin there, so we get our dressing room side by side, so we get to see quite a bit of the basketball team. We became friends over the past four years, obviously, and uh, obviously we're wishing them the best of luck against Kentucky. Yeah, what do you think is going to happen? That's the next question. Well, Badgers, obviously. Yeah, for sure. <laughs> well, what about you, you mentioned uh, talking about adjusting and getting level, or getting uh, used to the level here at, at the ECHL, the AA level. How different is that from college hockey? Um, I mean, college prepares you pretty well for it. I mean, it's obviously a little different. Everybody's a little bigger here, a little stronger. Um, but uh, I don't know. College obviously prepares you well, but it was nice to uh, it was nice to get a feel for things here and uh, and now. Goalies are always a different breed. What type of goalie are you? Some guys like uh, Riley Gill's really relaxed. One of those easygoing guys. Aaron Dell, who was here earlier in the year, really relaxed. How about you? What do you like on game days? Um, I like to keep it light. I like joking around. I kind of I don't like getting too nervous out there. Then I get too tight and I don't feel comfortable out there. So I try to keep it light as I can and uh, and uh, try to stay as normal as possible. I don't think I'm too worried of a goal. Obviously, the Sharks saw something in you. Uh, just talk about that experience and, and going to Worcester for a little bit. Yeah, I mean, it was obviously nice to uh, to uh, be a part of the Sharks organization. I was extremely excited to have the opportunity to do that. And then to head out to Worcester for a little bit and get to see what the AHL was like and see um, how things are around there was, uh, was a really good experience. And, uh, and now I'm down here, so I got to, got to see quite a bit in the past couple of weeks here. How much did you know about Allen, Texas before you came here? Uh, not too much. I've never been to Texas. I've never really been down this far south before. So um, it, was, uh, it was a cool experience. I hopped off the airplane in my jeans and a jacket. I was uh, sweating within a couple of minutes. It was snowing in Worcester when I left. Saskatchewan boy. Mm-hmm. What, uh, what did the parents uh, say when they found out you were coming to Texas? <laughs> I think they probably pulled out a map and tried to figure out where Allen was. <laughs> but uh, they're pretty excited. I mean... Um, Obviously, it's a long ways, but I'm sure they're they're trying their best to get down here. What about your teammates? Uh, and obviously, uh, there's been uh, several new faces in the locker room of late. Uh, Everly coming in, uh, you know, yourself, uh, you you name it. We it seemed like it's introduce yourself to somebody new on the bus every day. Uh, but w- what's it been like uh, in the room with these guys? Yeah, it's been uh, it's been nice getting to know a new team. Obviously, um, yeah, you say Everly and Dyson Stevenson just got in, and me. So we got three Saskatchewan boys which is a nice dynamic in the locker room down here in Texas. Did you guys know each other at all? Uh, yeah, we played against each other growing up. I knew Dyson, he lived pretty close to me, but I didn't really know I really personally. So, um, yeah, it was nice to, to have those guys here. Well, just, I guess, a couple last questions uh, for the Allen fans who want to get to know you. What do you like to do in your, in your off time when you're not playing hockey? Um, you know, I like... Good, uh, good movie or two. I don't know. I, I like golfing. I like uh, being by water. Um, yeah, I don't know. Don't do too much besides hockey when it's hockey season. So, what's your favorite movie? Ah, <laughs> uh, anything with Will Ferrell or uh, or Kevin Hart. Those are always my favorite. You could go to dinner with one person, one famous person. Yeah, maybe a hockey player. Might be an actor, actress. Mm-hmm. Who would it be? Um, I don't know. I think. Uh, Terry Sawchuk would be pretty cool. But, wow. Uh, old school goalie. Old school. Hold some records to ask him a few uh, few questions. And last but not least, who was your favorite goaltender growing up? Uh, probably Patrick Law was my favorite. Uh, we're in 29 here, but I was 33 in Wisconsin, so uh, Law was, uh, was somebody I looked up to growing up. Uh, one more time, let's hear it go Badgers. <laughs> here we go Badgers. Good luck.